Hey everybody, how's it going? We're back on Super Auto Pets. Uh, we're still hanging around the kind of summon build era, uh, but it'll definitely be a little different as will be the will be the hooting lizards. I'm sure there's a lizard that hoots. Yeah, we're gonna stick around with summons, but it'll be a little different. Uh, I really want to build a squad around the amoeba. Um, and I'm sure if you've played this game for, you know, at least a couple hours, you're aware of the... Let's sell here and go ant. You kind of know what's up with the with the amoeba and summon builds. But, uh, you know, when we get the amoeba, we'll take a little bit closer look at it. Um, yeah, when we get there, we get there. Uh, but I hope everybody had a good weekend. You know, if you're watching this... You know, this week, you're not watching it on the weekend. Um, you know, it's pretty hard to complain about a three-day weekend, especially with weather this nice. You know, in Canada, we had the three-day weekend because of Remembrance Day. So it was nice to just relax, reset, and, you know, get some nice, like, even footing for uh, this week. So not much to complain about, honestly. Um, but I find, like, Mondays, you really gotta get into them, you know? Monday's my day where I really gotta get momentum for the week. Let's get a level here. Capybara for next turn, I think, is fine. I'm not gonna bother with the Cricket, because it'll go soon. Yeah, we'll leave it here. Yeah, I find, like, I really just... I need Mondays to really propel me through the week. Um, so hopefully I'm able to have a nice little start, you know? Um, I think we're, I, I think so far, so good. And, and you know, a couple 10 pieces on this video would be the chef's kiss. Just really get me skipping along here. So let's get a level on the horse. I think we kind of have to go whale. So let's pill. And we're going to put the whale here. Stork is not like, uh, quite frankly, I don't think Stork is a great pet. I think he's pretty good in weeklies when you can get him level 2 and surprise some people, but he's a little underwhelming here, but uh, we'll run him for a bit and see how it goes. I think this is going to be a little tough to get over here. Hmm, let's see. Oh, we might be okay. We might skate by. Alrighty, so that takes us to what? Five. Great start. Great start here. I'm not going to bother... You know what? I will. Just because we don't really put our gold into too, too much else. Maybe just in case we get nothing. Whoa. Let's just chill for a second here. You're gone. You're in. You're here. Don't really care about the... Uh, the honey. The, 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 the bee coming out. I think we're fine here. This is not great. The deer is really going to put some... Put a damper on this squad here. And I don't know if we're going to be able to pull it out. Oh, you know what? We might be. We'll draw for... It leveled itself up. That's some slick tech there, my friend. That's slick. Very sneaky. All right. We'll level the whale. I guess we'll level the whale to level two. Monkey is just not... Monkey's not what I'm looking for right now. So we're going to keep it moving? Okay. Here we go. So, Microbe dies, gives everything weakness. And our pets don't care at all about weakness or held food, for that matter. Because they all just spawn again. So, we're looking to even the playing field in terms of equipment and then we just got to keep our squad uh like moving in the right direction enough so we're gonna sell you and bring out a deer that's a big upgrade for us big big you know what whale i'll get you level three i don't think i'm gonna keep the whale and sell the horse like i did the last game i think i've learned my lesson but i think horse has a lot to prove here horse Horse has got to have a big game for us to really be pleased with it. And we'll take this one quite easily. And we're good here quite easily with our level 2 horse just left. 
So it takes us to seven. Looking good, looking good. Eat. Mm, obviously not gonna bother <laughs> with the level two microbe. Anteater's better. It just is. Level three horse incoming. And we desperately need something to get rid of the horse. Level three whale incoming for sure. That's, that's for sure. This one might be a, a bit of a tough go for us. Yeah. Matt, there's some really, some, some really strong teams that take us out. Like big hippo, big rhino, octopus, snake are very, very common ones that absolutely steamroll this squad. You are better than this. So I take you. I think for now, shark is going to be better. But I'm not happy about it. You know? Shark is not something that I think... It's, it's a little clunky, I think, in this application. But I do think we'll pull this one out. Yeah. This squad, I think, in like two turns is going to be disgusting. But I think we... We preyed on them a little bit. All right. We'd love to get rid of Shark. I think Fly is going to put in work for us. <clears throat> is it Fly or Turkey? Is it Fly or is it Turkey? You know what? The game has spoken. It's Turkey. I think there's a world we could also go Vulture. You know what? Maybe we'll just test them all and just see which one is better. This was clearly not indicative of the strength of... Oh, almost there. That was not indicative of the strength of the turkey. So let's give it another chance here. Oh, yeah. You're gone. You are in. And then spitting out a level 3 Orca is going to be... Fantastic. Maybe a freeze me, but I think the eagle is is not long for this world. Let's see here. The orca in the back is a bit scary, but I think we can get there. The melon on the uh Oh yeah, we're good here. The melon was a great snag for us. That that turtle was a great spawn. <clears throat> Alright. We are on game point. So I guess we'll level here. Freeze the chocolate for who knows. All right. Put it all out there. Level three horse. Or I can't say level three horse. Level three whale. Let's see if it takes us home. Uh, I don't know, Matt. Snake is, is pretty nasty here. Oh, if it hit the snake, that would have been... That would have been it, man. I think we still take it home. All righty. The level three whale got us there. Okay, so I think of the three options to have in my back row here with turkey, fly, and vulture, I would say, the I think the vulture is going to be the strongest, but I'm not going to kick this out of bed for eating crackers. So you know what? Let's run it back and let's see if we can... Run something else in that back little slot. And then we can really find out. And we'll go a couple ducks here. We'll be the green cuties. Yeah, so that's basically how the team goes. Uh, the, <clears throat> excuse me. The microbe really levels the playing field. And then you just got to get a little scummy with everything else and you're good. Uh, I'll probably go ant here. All right. <clears throat> so Sunday's usually my day for picking up groceries. Um, so went out yesterday, got my groceries. And man, the grocery store is absolute. It's the Wild West. People either walk way too slow or way too fast. And they hog up the aisles, man. Like, people be standing... A little spider here, and then 
level next turn. Horse would be a great grab. Cool. <clears throat> People stand in the middle of the aisle or at one end of the aisle to look on the other side. Like, have some common courtesy. Like, just figure it out. Okay? It's not that hard. I want to use the aisle two. Oh, get myself revved up here. <clears throat> I think another big issue of mine at the grocery store is the self-checkouts. And uh, let's level here before we sell the ducks. Yeah. I guess we'll go blowfish in the interim. And you live a bit. <clears throat> the self-checkouts. And not for the reason you may think. I am not a fan of the self-checkouts because of how many items you are allowed to use at them. I strongly believe, <coughs> excuse me, I strongly believe and will go to war that the self-checkout should be express only. 15 items or less, okay? When you're bringing 20 individual pieces of produce, you don't know the codes to the produce and it takes 15 minutes. <clears throat> there you're usually with somebody else so you're chatting shit then <clears throat> excuse me i got something in my throat this grocery store anecdote is just hurting here you're usually with somebody else so you're chatting shit not paying attention your items aren't scanning so every five seconds deer is a sick pickup here every five seconds you're calling over the attendant uh, oh, I didn't take it off the scale. It blah, blah. And then they just, they don't even look at it. They just reset it. Look, there should be a maximum of items that you are allowed to take into the self-checkout. Or, or the self-checkout kiosks. You got to keep it moving. Like, that's for speed. Okay? You're gone. Dear me. <clears throat> I'm a whale fan now. All it takes is one game. Ooh. Nah, sheep's better. You're gone. You're here. Uh, like this, and you live. I think for the re that reason, I don't really use the self-checkouts. You know, like... <clears throat> out of principle. And this squad is going to take us out, I feel here. Oh, I don't know. It's going to be close. Man, some builds are so good, especially early. They are quite, quite strong. Let's see if we can get a level here. That would be really nice. Speak of the devil. Moose is a, is a sleeper, I think. Freeze me. <clears throat> All right, so what are we going on the back here? What are we going to go on the back here? <clears throat> I think we're going to go Vulture. I mean, it, it's really up to the shops. Like, what are the shops going to give us? And we'll win by one. Nice little horse. You know what was the winner there? The peach. I gave it the peach and it lived. <clears throat> Let's give you some help. You're gone. You're here. Vulture, here's your chance, baby. We don't have the microbe yet. <clears throat> but I think mm, maybe the sheep will go. I feel like that's a, uh, we'll decide at a later date. Great snipes. Wow, elephant blowfish with a pineapple. Just run summon builds, man. Like why you gotta run dumb sicko builds like that? You're here, <laughs> he goes in. <clears throat> yeah, we'll run it like this, I think. Okay, microbe. I don't know, man. I think I think in this specific application, the microbe <laughs> is better with the sheep because it's going to give us more triggers on the vulture. And you know what? That blowfish pineapple inspired me. Take a blowfish, man. Eat. Don't get sniped or I'll be really chapped. <clears throat> yeah, nice. Looks like we'll be okay here. Yeah, and we'll be good here. It was a little close, so we, we got some work to do for sure. 
You and you. Orca is filthy. I want to freeze this here, but I think there's more important freezes to be had. <clears throat> yeah, we'll run it like this. Level two deer can stand on its own four legs. Okay, it's us, but weaker. <clears throat> yeah, it's us, but weaker. If we can get to the, the dog, we'll be, we'll be all right. Which we will. And we're good, okay. So Vulture, I don't know, man. I, I, right now I still think the, uh, <clears throat> the turkey's better, but we got a ways to go. Okay, level two microbe, just kidding. Tapir is, this is not the right application for the tapir. You know what? No, you're not going to live. I was thinking put that on there, it'll live a snipe, but it's not quite there yet. So let's try and get another level three whale. Level three whale and orca is filthy. <clears throat> this, this is an interesting squad. Interesting. Okay, where are we at here? Should be okay, and a draw. Oof. <clears throat> That's the fun thing about summon builds, man. Like, in situations like that, you never know what's gonna go. All right, we got levels on deck. Would love one level next turn. I think that would really ease my heart. Hmm, and I think we should be okay here. We're going to need some big summons there, which I don't think we got. Yeah. That was a tough one. I think we got some really tough luck there. Don't know if that really shows off the vulture, so we might have to run it again. But uh, I think we'll leave it there. I think we leave it there. I think for now, I'm going to I'm gonna put the turkey on top. But I guess we'll see. So thanks, everybody, for watching. And uh, we'll catch you in the next one. See ya.